All right, Will here with Into Mobile at Mobile World Congress. We're at the HTC booth, and actually we're going to take a quick look at what uh, HTC has done with their Sense UI. Um, they kind of revamped Sense to make it a little cooler, a little easier to use, but overall just way, uh, way more useful. And this is the Android home screen. This is an HTC legend. This is the Android home screen, and it's not standard vanilla Android. What it is is completely customized yeah, according to uh, HTC's uh, Sense design philosophy. And there, you know, it's got the multiple panes, right? You can uh, slide from left to right, and you get, you know, friends stream, which we'll talk about in a second. You get all your uh, different, you know, home screen panes where you can put different widgets. You can hold on to them and move them around or even put them in the trash. And uh, we're not going to do that because, you know, it's not my phone. But as you can see, it's all very customizable, right? Well, we're used to that. What HTC did was they changed it and they put a little bit of a spin on the Sense UI. And if you come in right here, you can see what there's a feature called Leap. It's like leaping from window to window. So instead of scrolling from pane to pane, which can kind of be a pain in the butt, it's a pinch gesture right there. I don't know if you guys saw that, but a real quick pinch kind of puts all those panes into one grid view. So instead of having to go from friend stream and go all the way to your weather app, I can go from my weather app. Instead of going all the way to the other side of the pane, I just pinch it and maybe I want to go to my, um, right there, my news feed. So leap is a new pinch gesture that's built into, into the Sense home screen. But there's a couple new things. There's uh, something called FriendStream, and FriendStream is like your centralized social networking hub. And if you come in here, I'll show you what FriendStream looks like. It's right there, full screen. You get all your uh, social network updates. You can update straight from the home screen. And if you tap that right there, you go to all your updates and you could get a, a comprehensive view of all your activity. And down here, of course, you know, you're sharing, you're linking, your refresh buttons and all that stuff. But there's also one other thing that's new. It's the news feed. So just like FriendStream, you get to stay in, t uh, in touch with all your news updates from the home screen nice and easy and of course just tapping it like that is going to go straight to the news story. Now, uh, okay, so that wasn't the only thing. One more thing I want to show you guys is when we go to that news feed, we're going to let it load for a second. When we go to the news feed and we tap something here, it's if you find a cool story but you don't, you don't know what a word means, for example, uh, well, you know, it doesn't have to be any super hard word, but let's let it load for a second. And let's say we're not sure what one of these words is. Well, I'm just going to hold down. Okay, so I'm going to hold it down like that. I'm going to highlight a word. And okay, you see right there, I highlighted a word. And what I can do with that word is I can look it up. Sorry. I can look it up. in Google Dictionary. So I get to di a dictionary definition of the word that I don't know. Well, obviously I know what first means, but say you didn't know, you could get a definition for that. You can get a Wikipedia entry for that bit of text. You can look it up on the web, all that cool stuff, and all without leaving the app. It's all integrated. And one more thing, let's say you don't know a phrase. Let's say you, you want to figure out, you know, what does that word mean? What does that phrase mean? in a different language. Well, English to English doesn't work, but we can go from, say, English to German. So we're uh, straight, you know, within the app, totally integrated in sense. I go from English to German right there in the app, and when I'm done, I go back and I keep reading my story. So those are a few cool new features in uh, the Android home screen, thanks to HTC's revamped sense home screen.